Hello and welcome to the short board on Parshas Baloscha. For those of you in Chutz Laaretz, this is live from Eretz Yisrael, Mea Sha'arim. In Parakid Aleph, the Bnei Yisrael, even though they have the man, that's a miraculous food, it's totally spiritual, no waste products, and it tastes like what you want if you merit it. They said, we missed the fish, the dug that we had in Egypt, as well as other uh, food, meat and, and, and onions and uh, garlic. So the ultimate Slobodka asked, how could it be that the Bnei Yisrael that experienced Yitzhiz Mitzray and Kriyas Yamsuf, all these miracles, Matan Torah, that they would be wanting physical things like the bus are instead of the, being satisfied with the spiritual thing. So the, the Altus Slobodka explains that the world was created in a totally spiritual basis, but when man does something, he can make something into um, something more earthy and, and more gashmi. And uh, on the other hand, if he does it something properly, then he can make it more ruchnius and elevated. So example, when you eat the lechem, you eat the bread, then the bread, if you, it's all done properly, then you're gonna have, uh, it's like a korban, like, a, like an offering. And then the, the table that you eat on becomes like a mizbeach, and, and the yai and the wine that you drink becomes, becomes uh, the libations of the offerings. And that's what the Bnei Yisrael want. It's not that they wanted the Gashmi. What they wanted to do, they wanted something, the opportunity to elevate the Gashmias, to make this something into spiritual and do that. However, so therefore, you know, the question becomes, well, why then did they um, get punished? Why was it considered a bad thing? The answer that the altar gives is that some, sometimes Hashem tells them specifically something to do and gives them... Um, something spiritual like this, then it's not our job to take it down to bring it back up. Hashem had a reason. He knows our needs. He knows our inclinations. And he knows how this will affect us. And therefore, there was a purpose why we were given mun and not done something physical that we could elevate. So thank you for listening. Have a wonderful week and a wonderful Shabbat Shalom.